Hi guys, in today's video I'm going to show you how to recycle a non leos container to make this adorable USB flash drive. This is a collab with Sue or DIY lover here on YouTube, she's doing a super cool back to school video. Her channel is full of very unique DIYs, so I'm going to leave her link down below so you can check her out. To begin with this DIY, we are going to need a Neos container that is empty and clean like this. To make the fake lip balm, we are going to use oven baked clay. Here you can choose the color you want, I decided to mix these colors together to create kinda like a dark lilac. Now that you have the color you want, take a small piece and start rolling it with your hands to make a little ball like this. Now use the tool of your choice to divide the ball in half like I'm doing here. Take one half and start creating the shape of the EOS lip balm using your fingers. Keep moving the clay until it looks super smooth and clean. Now we need a super tiny USB flash drive. If you want to have this exact one, I'm going to leave the link in the description box. With the USB, we are going to create a guide on the clay. This guide is going to help us know where exactly we need to carve a hole so the USB can fit perfectly in place. Very carefully remove the clay using something pointy or an exacto knife. The heat from our hands makes the clay super soft and we can ruin what we have done. So we need to put this in the freezer for a couple of minutes so it can harden. And that's going to help to separate the clay from the EOS container easily without ruining it. And we need to do this because we need to bake our fake lip balm. Follow the directions that came with your clay and now it's time to bake. When the clay isn't hot anymore, it's time to continue. Use a strong glue like the E6000 glue to attach the clay to the divider of the EOS. Now to make the clay shiny, I'm going to add a thin layer of this gloss finish mold pot. This is going to create the illusion that it's a real lip balm when in reality it's not. And now all we have left to do is to add glue to the USB and place it directly to the hole that we just created. Let it dry and that's it! This is the final result, in my opinion it looks super cool and I haven't seen anything like this on YouTube. I think this is one of my favorite DIYs that I have ever made. Don't forget to check my friend's video if you want to see more back to school videos. I love you guys so so much and I see you in my next video very soon. Bye!